Hello everyone, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how to make a DM log since it was requested by someone in the last video's comment. So now let's hop into the video. Before we start the video, I want you to know that you can get Source Club by joining our server, link in the description, and you'll find here in the information channel, GitHub. Okay guys, so, first of all, we're gonna go to our index.js and search for the message event. Once you're in your message event, if you have this, just delete it, okay? Like that. And now, you're gonna do if I put this in here so if the message dot channel dot type is the DM so we're gonna do like that we're gonna create an embed so const DM embed equal new discord dot message embed okay so now we're gonna do dot set title so we can set a title for that embed and we gonna name it like new dm okay and now we can set a color so we're gonna put a random color and then a timestamp okay so I'll do it like that and then we can put a description this video is going to be kind of fast because it is not really hard to make a DM log. So, the description will be first of all, who is the user who uh, sent the DM. So we're going to put like that, user. And then, you're going to put here the username, uh, uh, that message author I mean. So it's going to be message dot author dot tag okay and then we can put line break and then we're gonna put here the user id okay so we're gonna put user id and then here we're gonna put message dot author dot id and then another line break and we're gonna put over here uh like at so you can know when did he send it i'm gonna just pass here a new date okay you can just put it uh, like stuff you want any language anytime but here you're gonna just say pretty specific you'll see how it will be and now we can put two line breaks and then we're gonna put here the content so content like that and then we can just put two points here and we've got two points here. Here we can pass a like three of those a coding block. And we're gonna put over here the message dot content. Oops, I forgot the dot. So dot content, and then like that. Okay. Now we can do message dot channel dot send or actually not message or channel let's first def okay wait now we made the embed okay we want first to check where will the bot send it okay so we're gonna put const dm channel I'm gonna, I'm gonna name it dmc equal client dot channels dot cache dot get and we're gonna put here the channel ID that where we want the bot to send the embed. We want the bot to send the embed. So we're gonna go here. Let me use this one. I'm gonna paste it here. And then we're gonna put uh, dmc.send. Uh, we're gonna put here the dm embed. Okay, the embed we made it here. You can also make the bot respond by something if you want to, and like you can just control those stuff if you want to. 
but I will just keep it as simple as this as it is just a DM log. Now let's run the bot, no dot. Oops, uh, yeah, this folder is just my MacBook randomly generated, never mind. Let's run the bot again. Okay, there we go, TurboBot is online. Now, if I try to DM it anything, like, hello. Okay, if I went over here, you're gonna see new DM, user, user, ultra x, user id, if I try to get my id here real quick, as you can see, they're all the same id, and here at, it says the day, and when exactly, and with, and with what time, like GMT plus 2, and the message content is here, so I can just use it to do anything, like here. Please like and subscribe and don't forget like you always do here. Okay, if I went here, I'm gonna see new. And there, it logged the DM. So, that was it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like and to subscribe and to leave a comment down below what you want the next video to be. That's it, and ciao.